Okie dokie, Smokey. We are in. Yeah, I keep forgetting that. It's like, wait a minute here. I'm doing the videos for myself primarily. Yeah, I know. And then I start getting sidetracked and I remember that, um, well, so, you know, other people are like, hey, I'm interested in watching. So, I mean, I alter my whatevers, but there's a lot going on in my head about with this stuff. And I was like, oh, shoot, I should be trying to articulate some of it for later. And uh, I was like, well, maybe other people would be interested. I mean, so away we go. But, um, you know, I missed out a ton of stuff. Um, I'll say this. Um, hold on. It's slow. Let me go get a sip. Yeah, I've got a, a sign. So I've got to get a pink dude. Okay, hold on. Yeah, I forgot about that Calvary guy there. I've got to make another couple of movements over here as well. i got to check out my, I'm hoping it'll work. Uh, I'm going to try to do a second monitor and set that up. I hope that works for the live stream. We'll see. All right. Uh, what was I going to say I was going to do? Oh, yeah, a pink thing. Yeah, I forgot about that cavalry. I'll have to assign it to um, the second core. Yeah, I've been trying to... Well, I guess maybe I should just start with it. Huh? Did, it did it end already? Hold on. i got to switch over. Oh, shoot. That was a really nice track. Hmm. Now we're getting... In... Oh, did I want to do that, though? I don't know. Hmm. Let me see here. Oh, my F. Oh, my F. Oh, my F. Sorry, but there's like a, it's called the commando raid that stopped a German battleship. Oh, shit. It's about World War II. I'm such a dick for saying that, but I'm sorry. It's just the way my head is. I will try this and see if it works. If it doesn't, I'll just turn it off. I am such a bloody World War I Great War snob. What a dink. Yeah. I don't know what else to say. Oh, Lord of mercy. Um, actually, I don't mind listening to that again if I could. How did I get that? Hmm. Yeah, but oh, very well. It's well. I find that well, I didn't know. I like I'm still learning, but there's a lot of electronic music that people have taken and are like, oh, it's this version or it's that version, and you know they like they um. We'll even do things like um, um, record it, like uh, play it back at a slower um, um, frequency. And it's just like, whoa, there's all kinds of, or, you know, like a certain, it's just like, whoa, they, they get really into it. It's like on another level, I'm just, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm just like, I just, you know, if I enjoy it, I want to listen to it for crying out loud. All right, so let's pop a pink dude there. I was going to say, when I get to here, and this is why I'm doing a lot of weirdo movements, like I thought I had some stuff, but I'll just say this, if um, I'm still in like junior uh, officer class right now, I, I'm, I'm, I would be hoping to God that uh, every single bloody um, examiner was looking the other way, because boy, did I ever F this up, just bad, Be oh, son of a bitch bad. Okay, you want to see how bad? I'll explain to you how bad. All right. This is Redern. I don't know anything about him. Von Redern. Second Corps. His objectives is to secure this bit. Uh, you can see it's a shitload of swamp and just disgusting stuff. Um, his, and he, uh, so he's got to secure these positions and take this spot uh, so 2311 and 2211. So he has to take these two spots. Essentially, you close up this bit of the border. Up to this rail line. So he's got all this stuff. He's here. 20, 40, 60 kilometers away from the nearest kick-ass infantry uh, combat troops that are going towards there. He's got a guy stuck out here. Uh, zones of control left, right, and flip and center. He's got to limp along to get there. 
uh, this was just a massive screw up by me of not thinking ahead. Um, yep, yeah, that's just the way it is. Uh, and that's why I said, I hope to God some examiners are looking the other way. So I ended up uh, the 8th Festung Division from the Lotson uh, Garrison Corps, member by Charles Tortoise over there. Um, they've been released and I've assigned them to the uh, 2nd Corps. And I was like, okay, you've now just assigned them to the 2nd Corps. Guess what? He gets to, t to, to decide where they're going to go. Screw that. Originally, I was going to pop them there. I'm now going to pop them here. I'm going to rail them and just use this little... No one else is going to use this, for Christ's sakes. So I'm going to put them here. I've assigned the... Whatever these guys are, I'll find out, I'll find out of that in a minute. I'll pop them here. And what I'm going to try to do is block off the zones of control in a set... Well, I'm going to wave around here. Because I just have to get the hell out of here. Once I get to here, I'm going to rail like a mother. But I've got to start... Oh, shit, man. It's going to take two turns, isn't it? No, 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 no. Just, okay, so one turn to get to here. And then I move like a mother. All right. No problem. Yeah, once I get on the rail line, I can start attacking. Okay, goody two-shoes. All right, no problem. Okay, we'll do that then. It's just, oh, okay. <laughs> Till I get to here. I'm not going to say that, um, yeah, I'm kind of proud of myself in a weirdo way because it, uh, it happened, um, I just didn't, I didn't see it happen. Um, it happened organically or it happened. It's the same thing that happened. Um, oh gosh, was this two years ago or whatever? I don't know. Um, and I was, um, I inadvertently got, well, which is easy for me. I get sidetracked every three seconds. And um, I was out in the woods playing, um, uh, practicing my tin whistle and using tabs all the time as per usual. Something must have, must have distracted me, and I ended up playing the tune without looking. And it was the same feeling of you know I'm sure you uh, felt similar things of like you know like maybe the first time riding your bike and realizing no one's holding <laughs> holding the bike anymore, and you're like oh yeah. I mean I'm not saying it was that impactful or eventful, but I got to this point and I had to start making uh, recording moves that are not going to happen this turn. They're going to happen next turn. They have to happen next turn. I wanted to have them happen this turn. For example, this attack is not going to go through. I've got lots of other weirdo things to do first. Like, you know. And um, I've wanted to get to that spot. I was like, gosh, Chris, you need to get, like, start thinking a couple, like, you know, the way I used to play when I, like, I played chess way long time ago. And, you know, obviously, as I'm sure you guys know about chess, in the sense you can't, you know, if you're reacting one move to the next, you're in deep trouble. <laughs> anyway, so I was like, okay, here we go. And uh, I, so I was like, I want to get to that spot someday. And I could see it happening or the desire or the need. Or like, um, yeah, definitely the need. Um, it was imperative. It was essential. There was no way of going forward. Um and, um, I don't know. I just, I just was like, well, how do, how I, I got to this last night. I was like, um, I have to make, you know, this move, that move, that move. I was like, I can't do them right now. They have to happen next move. But I was like, I'm not going to remember these things, especially at the way, at the pace I've been playing. So what the hell do I do? And, um, so that's what I've decided to do. I, I guess, essentially <laughs> I wrote them down. I was like, holy cow, this is so cool. Yep. Um, yep. See? What's happening now is um, I'm now slipping off into knowing that other people may watch this. Does that make sense? So I'm now, you know what I mean? I have to get back to trying to articulate. Um, and it's, I'm not trying to be selfish or uh, inconsiderate. Trust me, it's not what I'm trying to do at all. And I'm sure I'll be slanting, you know, back the other way and, and not thinking about myself as much or whatever. Um, but um I really need to hammer home what the hell I'm doing here. So I have to start writing some stuff down is what I'm saying. So I've been trying, like I said, I've been trying to figure out of ways of closing it down. I also want to be not always, and I know it's impossible in every aspect. I mean, there's no way I can get rid of hindsight about, you know, thinking that way. And there's no way of getting rid of the game and so on and so forth and trying to be role playing and realistic. It's all none of, I'm never going to get an A plus. There's no perfections there there's nothing it's 
it's just is, you know, and, and I'm like, okay, I'm cool with that. So I've been, you know, um, just recording right now who, uh, which Fistung divisions are going which way and what. I don't know if I'm going to do the whole full on thing here. I don't know how long this thing's going to go on. I know some people love like super long videos and whatever. Like I said, I think actually lots of times um, because I babble on and on and on, um, maybe it's more like podcasty types. Well, it is for me in a sense, unless I'm like pointing at something. But that yet again is usually mostly, I think, um, for the, you know, anyways, watching or whatever. Anyways, let's get back to this. So I'm going to, yeah, I have to go to the book. Hold your horses. What am I saying? <laughs> Lord of mercy, and I'm just like, hold your horses, and that's exactly what I'm doing, is assigning um, <laughs> BG66, is it? Um, yep. And they're going to the second core, so I have to pop them in. That won't be hard to do. But I gotta move them. Oh, it's the ninth cavalry core. I've already assigned them to the second core, you silly bugger. I just didn't put a little thing. I must have missed them. Okay. No problem. That's even better. Do I have them written down, though? Nope. Because I didn't see them in the... Where did I? Nope, I don't see them. Nope, because I didn't have the little thing that you... All right. Oh, where am I going to put you? Where am I going to put you? Maybe a little spare. G66. That's it. Yep. And where are you going, my friend? Where are you going? Just a little bit, eh? Mind you, you got such great movement. Why would I waste you? Why would I waste you? Well, I'd waste you because um, I need to uh, attack here and here. Not down here, but I need to close her up. All right. And maybe I can wiggle around or something. All right. Let's figure this out. Okay, so you're going to go to 2012, eh? Oh, 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 oh. No, you're going to 1913. Hold on here. Or should you go to 2111? Should I keep the 2011 there? Just move the 2012 over. Yeah, but then I need someone here then too. Correct. Yo, whoop, that makes sense. All right, so 1913 goes there. Yep. Okay. So that means I have to move this guy first. And he takes up a rail spot. Mm-hmm. Sorry, 66, I gotta do 21 first. Number 21, 8th Fistung Infantry Division. You are now going to 2012, and I had to rail you there. I'm gonna record that down in the book too. stuff going on tomorrow too. I um yeah I gotta really have to start um hammering down with the timetable and the schedule because um um like I said I'm not uh complaining. I, I just I'm trying to be aware. The fact is is that um you know like I've got a um got a I'm, go I'm attending a lecture tomorrow night, and, um, and I got another one on Sunday or Monday. Shit, I can't, I can't remember anymore. I got it right there. I've got it written down. But uh, as in their ch um, um, eating up time that I used to use to prepare for the live stream and stuff. So it's like, okay, I have to be a little bit more, bit more efficient is what I'm saying. Uh, didn't it? Well, I'm glad of this. Trust me, I'm like I'm pinching myself. I'm like, what the hell? 
I'm invited to lectures and get to go to this, that, and the other thing. It's like, ah! But, um, you know, it takes up time. But man, what time it is, eh? Woohoo! Sweet Jesus jumping. All right, let's pop you in. 2012. Uh, tomorrow night uh, is on the Christmas truce. Oh, 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 ooh, ah, ooh, ooh. Do you have any idea <laughs> what I want to say to that? Woof, woof. Think about that, man. Think about that. I've been reading <laughs> Trench Warfare, the Live and Let Live system for how long now? Jeepers jumping. Huh. They're like, oh, you can talk about stuff afterwards. I'm like, oh, I so want to, but I'll shut up. I won't say anything. I feel, well, it's, yeah, I feel intimidated, obviously. Jeepers jumping. I'm dealing with, like, you know, like I've said before, it's like, oh, um, you know, when's your book coming out? I'm like, not me. <laughs> asking. So trust me, they, they, you know, ignore me. I mean, what the hell? I mean, ignore me in a, at that level. Of course, they're going to say hello and whatnot. But I mean, obviously, it's like you're a minnow. Shush. And respectfully so. I'm, they're not, um, you know, dissing me. It's like, you know, one lumps or two. You have, you don't even know what the hell sugar is, boy, or tea or coffee. Shush. Just go get the water. Maybe someday we'll let you boil it. Mm-hmm. Till then, sit at the kitty table. And guess what? I'm no problem there. I've got great hearing. Great hearing. I will listen, listen, listen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm-hmm. No problemo. All right, let's get you on the rails, boy. Let's get you on the rails. Mr. Eighth, I just used up. Oh, you're pretty good. I've only yeah, got, um, only used up 20%. I listened to this before? Yes, I have. Just not, yeah, I've listened to this version. And you started at 2010. Okay. Hmm. All right. Maybe listen to um, hmm. Can't think of any. That's tricky. Twenty twelve, eh? Yeah, I'll deal with the um, getting an attack a couple of times from now. In other words, there's a ton of reinforcements coming, and I know there's still some um, um, uh, more fist not a lot, a couple more fistung divisions popping out here. Since uh, the massively restrictive uh, train and everything, I'll, you know, I may send them there. We'll see. And there's also only single tracks, but um, still, eh? The Germans get to pop off two divisions through these freaking single tracks. Is there anything they can't do, man? 
<laughs> they can't get the Russians out of there. Oh, Lord have mercy. Yep. All righty. So you're in there. I popped you in. I'm just going to make sure everybody's happy. What does number 21 say? 2012, 2012. Okie doke. All right. So you are in. Uh, then I've got to pop you in second core. And 2012. Okay, let's make sure I got you in there. And then move the 9th Cowboy Division over just a wee bit. Seems ridiculous, but. Yeah, kind of craving for some, but no, I am kind of, well, I'm, I'm obviously craving a celestial sound, but all right, 1913, just to help me out, as if he's going to go anywhere, but I mean, I, I still got to play it out. Okay, 1912 to 1913. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I love the red, uh, the red, uh, the red giant, but um, oh, it's got such a beautiful breathing. So does Uranus. But um, mm. something a bit different. Uh, Saturn's interesting. I think I've mentioned it before that. Uh, Listen to it long enough, and I can start hearing uh, some interesting, interesting conversations, and uh, I like it. I like it a lot. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeepers jumping! All right, uh, 1913. Eh? And we just got to move the headquarters, and then I can see about um, doing some attacks soon. I want to um, make sure that all the um, uh, Festung divisions have been assigned. I've still got one, two, three, four, five more to go. Holy F. Oh, that's amazing. They had to be complaining. Oh, I've got so many Festung divisions to, to assign. Oh, my life sucks. Ah. Oh, trust me, man. The cupboard could be bare. And it's going to be in a bit, so shush. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe I need to wind her down or something. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know what the hell is going on with my head, man. That's all I know. Some days I'm like, um, well, I know I'm not, but because I'm, take a look, it's like, holy cow, you look like, uh, oof. I just dawned on me, I didn't realize how thin my skin is. I was like, just looking, I can't remember what the hell I was looking at, I was like, what the hell, I can see my bones from my, <laughs> when I like close my fist, I can see like, oh, it's just crazyville, man. I'm like, I should rent myself out or something. Must be some weird fetish people out there. Yep, I'm sure there are people who get off on. <laughs> oh, let's not go down. You don't want to go down my little. Uh, no, there. I've got like a. Trust me. I censor, censor, censor. Like even my brain knows I shouldn't say certain things on the video. Just in case, I'm in it. I forget what it is going up. I can give you some dots to connect. No, I won't do that. I will just shut up. Mm -hmm. All right, so you're done. You're off the books. Yeah, let's go back to here. I was going to talk a bit about this. So yeah, we're finished up here. I don't. There's not going to be no attacks. I think we've done some nice shifting. 
Still have to figure out what I'm going to do with this guy. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do anything with the 12th court. Not doing it. Maybe not a thing. I don't even... Well, they may get some reinforcements, but... Um, ahead of time, but I don't even know if I need to spring the... That's the weird thing. It, like, when I start getting into things such as... Um, Germans can like, you know, disembark into an enemy zone of control and away they go. And with uh, the double rail line, it's unlimited. Um, and the only thing stopping me of dropping people off in a hex is six uh, divisions worth, regardless of their strike points. Um, so I don't need to like pull the, or you know what I mean? Like even, uh, what do they call it? Cock the the gun back or whatever like I can, I can just fire right away next turn or so I don't have to do anything so I'm gonna take this guy off but I know it's been written down in the objectives okay I'm assuming 12th core 2007 let's take a look that's why it's written down man Of course, take two zero zero seven, two zero zero six. Shit, I think he's got a lot of fucking. Oops, sorry, he's got a lot of crap to do, man. Two zero zero six, two zero zero seven. But oh, I did it in uh, priority. That's why it's in two two zero zero seven, two zero zero six, two one zero six, and two one zero seven. So he has to take, I've told him, Schubert, the Ninth Army, you know, again, directly back to Hindenburg and everybody else. Um, by the way, you have to take this, these 20 kilometers, that 20 kilometers, that 20 kilometers, and that, holy moly, in, um, Steve, uh, the week of the 14th to the 17th of November, and I want you to do this by the 30th. On your bike, boy. Like, oh my F. Oh yeah, and by the way, you've got nothing. <laughs> you got some cavalry and a couple of rinky dinks. Oh my God. Anyways, that's that. Okay. Don't worry. I'm, I'm out to help you. Just not this turn. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, and other than that, I've just loaded her up like there's no tomorrow. Uh, it's going to be interesting. That's why I'm not doing this. Like I wanted to start shifting uh, some of these troops over. I'm going to next week. Um, these guys are going to go to here. They're just going to cross the river. This guy's going to be split up. Uh, there's um, uh, two brigades here. The, uh, so one brigade's going to pop over here. The other one's going to stay there. That's all they're do uh, here for. The 11th course, just to stay here. Uh, 9th Army Direct with Schubert's doing all this, man. All of it. Um, and I've loaded her up as much as I can. Except this is going to be a combined attack. It's going to be an interesting thing. I'll let it go. Um, so it's going to be... I'm going to use just this guy. Yeah, and I brought over the cavalry just to protect my flank here. And then I'm going to use just... Uh, number 81 is going to go up against this guy here. And... Uh, it's, you know, 16 strength points, fully supplied in broken terrain. I'm just going to hope for the best and see what happens. And if I F up, I F up. Then I'm going in with 24, 28 strength points here across the woods, fully supplied. My ultimate thing is to realize that, you know, I'm going to be using up a lot of supply points, but, um... And trust me, um, 11th Corps is supplying his own dudes. Um, that's the way it's going. Um, I don't want to take chances. I think even if I rolled a 1 with a minus 2 on my die roll, I'm still guaranteed 2 hits, fully supplied with 28 strike points. I'm pretty damn sure. That's not too bad. That's the worst possible thing that can happen to me. Um, I need to... In other words, what... I, look. 
If I can start surrounding the living Dickens out of the entrenched position already, the way I'm looking at it, uh, I think the Russians will say, okay, let's get the hell out of here. I'm hoping. In other words, I just need to start making the crack bigger. You know what I mean? And, and just the, the momentum of the water or whatever, it's, it's just too much for the Russians to, um, to keep that much. That's what I'm hoping for. Because like I said, this is the primary objective politically, not military st strategically. I would, like I said, I think uh, personally, I, I, I want to um, snap this. I want to take this in half. Boink, and away we go. Because we're already kind of there. Anyways, I think that's about it. I'll take a look at this ridiculous nonsense and stop, I think. Uh, see, I'm already planning on the whatever, but um, I'm going to go and wander off and do whatever. I should go start shutting stuff down, I think. Like I said, i got to figure out about the other whatevers. And i got to switch this music. It's getting a bit wacky wookie. Okay. That's about it. I think, yeah, I don't, uh, my bandwidth or whatever, so it's going to go mental.